Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a clothing haul. I've been doing a little bit of shopping of this amazing weather that we've been having because it's finally sunny and warm and I'm just so excited I don't want to jinx it but I have lots of cute summer pieces here from dresses to skirts and tops a little bit of everything and I also have two accessories to share with you as well so I hope you guys enjoy this and let's get started. I also wanted to mention that my BP camisoles are finally back in stock. They only seem to bring these back periodically but they're some of my favorites and they're a really nice affordable alternative to my cami NYC ones. My cami NYC ones are obviously pure silk which is why they're so expensive and these ones aren't but the fit of these are really really nice and it's difficult to find a really good fitting camisole that also washes well as well and these really do it's what i'm wearing here today and they have a few different colors so if you're interested in checking these out i will leave the direct link for it down below so first up is this dress which is a little bit crinkled because i did wear it out the other day um but i love this this is from a brand called capulet i own one other dress from them and they do the cutest pieces i've never heard of them before but they're stocked on a few sites i think they're stocked on shopbop um but i got this from revolve how pretty is that i'm a sucker for a good floral midi dress and this just has the prettiest flow to it it is a button down as well it's coming up very bright um, on the camera it is very sunny so apologies but i will try everything on so you get a good idea of how it looks like on me i just love the fit of this it is on the longer side so if you are very petite then this may not work on you but i'm a little bit taller at 5 7 so i think it works great especially with a pair of heels as well and i love this to bit so very cute it's a really pretty shade of blue and it has these beautiful kind of vintage looking peach roses that's the best way i can think to describe it but very very sweet and just a really cute kind of swishy tea dress so love this i think it's adorable another piece also from revolve is this skirt and as soon as i saw this i knew i had to get it i thought it was so lovely it's kind it's not really a floral print it's kind of like an abstract print um but it's this beautiful purple color verging on lilac i'd say and then it also has these kind of peach and black dots everywhere it's all very abstract but i love how swishy it is it's very very crease proof which is always a big win for me and my favorite thing about it is this side slit i love a good side slit i think it can completely make a piece and this is just so cute it isn't lined which is the only thing i was a little bit concerned that it would be see-through but i don't really think it is i tried it with a few different underwear pieces and i can never seem to see my underwear which is always a very big bonus I thought this was so lovely. I'm planning just on wearing this either with a bodysuit, maybe a white tee, or maybe even like a little crop top. I think it'd be very, very cute. So super excited about this. I think it's so beautiful and I just love the flow of it. Next up is this black skirt. And this is more of like a serious piece, but I am always on the lookout for really good black skirts, especially nice weighted pleated ones. I love pleated skirts. I think they are an absolute wardrobe classic and I rely on them a lot because they are so easy to wear and they're also good for a whole variety of different occasions. You know, they're good for work, they're good for casual, they're good for date night. They just seem to work for everything. And I love this one because it has a bit more of a weight to it. So it's kind of like a knit, but it's not so heavyweight that you're not going to be able to wear it in the warmer months. So I love this. I think it's from Halogen. Yes, it's from Halogen. Really nice swish to it as well. But again, because you have that weight, it just holds its structure really well. Such a good length as well. And a good classic black skirt is never gonna do you wrong. Just such a great wardrobe piece. Next up is this orange dress. And that's not a sentence I say very often. I don't think I have any other orange items in my wardrobe because orange really isn't a color I gravitate towards. But I saw this and I thought that the fit looked really cute. So I decided to give it a go. I'm so glad I did because I think it's so lovely. So it has, it's a mini dress um, and it has these kind of multi-tiered layers i guess around the skirt it just cinches in in the waist around the middle and then it has this halt neck at the top really cute it is a double layered so it's very light but you also get enough kind of material so you're not showing anything very cute and flirty perfect for a girl's night out i think really lovely and the color is more of like a burnt orange so it's not like really in your face and it has this really beautiful kind of vintage like floral pattern so I'm a huge fan of this. I think it's so lovely. I think it'd be especially cute if you're gonna pair up like a ponytail and some heels. Just very fun and flirty and just a really, really nice dress. Next up is a tank top. This is from Billabong and I'm not really one to shop at Billabong very often because I do think of it as a younger person brand, 
but I saw this and I thought it was so cute and I thought it'd be perfect to wear with just denim shorts. I'm going away shortly and I'm anticipating wearing denim shorts a lot, so I thought this would just be a nice, easy breezy one to kind of tuck in, especially if you're just going to, you know, like the pool or breakfast or something like that. A really nice holiday piece, which isn't so expensive that you're gonna worry about ruining it, but I still think it's very cute. Just this cream colored background with a black and red floral print, and it has this really pretty kind of ruffle detail around the neckline, and it also cinches with a tie as well. It has adjustable straps, which is always great because I always always think it makes for a much much better fit and I love this so very very impressed with this for you know Billabong again not a store I usually go for but um, I thought this was really lovely next up are a couple of pieces from ASOS and the first one is from Warehouse I believe yeah it's from Warehouse and it's a super cute little dress it's this very nice kind of military olive green really lovely and it looks like it's a straight down dress but it actually cinches in in the waist which is what gives it the shape it has buttons all the way down the front and then it has two pockets as well so, so cute. I think this would be really cute either dressed down with a pair of sandals or if you wanted to dress it up with a pair of heels, I think that would look really good as well. I just love the whole concept of this dress. So, so cute from ASOS and obviously from ASOS and not too expensive either. I just love this. I also found this really cute crop top and I am so in love with the colors. I think it's so, so pretty. So it is an off the shoulder one. It has ruching all over. I feel like I'm seeing ruching a lot, but if you get the right kind of item, I think it can be so flattering. And the colors are just so pretty. It's this really beautiful dark blue, but with a daisy print as well. So you also have the white and yellow. Super pretty, and I love this sort of thing with a nice midi skirt. You can just see a tiny little bit of stomach, you know, not too much, but just so adorable and just very comfortable and easy to wear as well, I think. Next up is a black top, and again, not the most exciting thing in the world, but I love tops like this. I just think they're so cute, especially to wear it with a skirt, but again, you can wear this sort of thing with jeans if you wanted to. I had something very similar, but it didn't last very long because the stitching kind of came apart on the hem. So I'm hoping this one is going to last a little bit better, but I love this. I love the fit of it as well. This one came in a few different colors, but I always go for black just because I find them to be a lot more versatile and I just get a lot more use out of them than if I go for a bright color, but there are bright color options available if you're not as boring as me when it comes to color choices. It buttons at the back as well, really nice fit, very, very cute, and again, something that you'll just be able to wear with so many different outfits, I think. So I love this. I think it's so flattering as well on the shoulders and arms, and oh, just the prettiest top. And I have another maxi dress right here, which is from One Dot State, I think, yes. Very, very cute. I love the fact that this has kind of a Grecian vibe to it, so I think it'd be really cute with just some flat sandals, maybe some gold earrings. Really lovely. It has a beautiful neckline as well, so it is kind of a square neckline, but it's a rounded one, so much more flattering than a kind of straight square neckline. It has adjustable straps again, and it has this really nice ruching detail, but only across the kind of midsection, so just below the bust. It's a nice length as well, so it does go all the way down, but it just shows my sandals, at least on me anyway with my height. And it does have a side slit as well. Really nice fabric, very nice for some as well. It is lined, but only kind of just past your bum, so kind of halfway down your thighs, if that makes sense. Um, so you do have a lot of freedom of movement for your legs. I love the color. It comes in black as well, but I went for this kind of deep red color. Really, really pretty, and I just love the shape of it. And then for my last ASOS piece, I have this beautiful skirt. This is from ASOS's own kind of in-house label, which I actually think produces some really nice items. A few of my favorite things that I've ever found from ASOS are ASOS own design. And I saw this skirt and I just thought it was right up my street. It's a very light fabric, um, so it's not kind of a particularly structured one. But I thought the design was so pretty. So it has buttons down the front, but again, it's kind of asymmetrical. And then it has a ruffle all the way down, well not all the way down, but kind of from about three quarters of the way down. It does have a little bit of an asymmetrical cut even down below, so you show a little bit more leg. And then on the back, you just have that ruffle tear. So, so cute. I love the colors as well. It's this really pretty kind of periwinkle blue, um, but it has all these different colors for, it's kind of a floral print, but it's more abstract than that. You have reds and greens, whites, yellows, just pretty much every color, but I think it really works. 
just such a pretty skirt. And for my very last clothing piece, I have this absolutely adorable H&M dress. These are really similar to the Nordstrom ones slash the self-portrait ones, but it's a shorter version. Very cute for summer. This comes in the blue as well. I went for the white because I was on the lookout for a really cute white summer dress and I love this so much. It feels amazing quality as well. I think this was only, oh, I already took the tags off, but I think this was only 35 pounds, so not too much at all. It has adjustable straps as well. I think it's just the prettiest thing. So I am so in love with this. I'm so excited to wear it. I love the neckline. I love the fact that it flares out a little bit. I just like everything about this. So very, very happy with this one. And on to my accessories now, and I have two items to share with you. So the first one is a pair of wedges. I've been on the lookout for a good pair of wedges for years now, pretty much, and I had originally bought these, I think it was a couple of months ago, when my Teresa did a discount code, but I tried them in a different fabric, and I tried them on, and they just weren't very comfortable, so they went back, because I know if wedges aren't comfortable, I'm not going to wear them, but then they had their summer sale, and these went in the sale, which were the same style, but a different fabric, so these are the suede, and I probably should have tried the suede originally, because I know suede shoes are just so much more comfortable comfortable than pretty much any other kind of fabric I feel and these are so different I absolutely love them they're this really pretty kind of pale dusky pink so very neutral and it has this really pretty kind of pink white weave if that makes sense it has a little gold touch as well with the Jimmy Choo logo and these are so so comfortable so I am very excited about these especially now that my wedge search is finally over because honestly it's been so long um, but yeah absolutely thrilled to bits of these especially the fact that I managed to get them on sale and for my very last item I did get something from Saint Laurent but this is actually a giveaway prize so I'm giving this away in this video I had a Louise V Aroma gift voucher because I don't know if you guys know this but uh, if you buy a lot from Louise V Aroma you collect points and then after I think it's like two or three months, the points convert into vouchers that you can then spend. And I had a 200 pound voucher off some bags that I bought before, and there was nothing that I really wanted, and I saw this, it was so cute, but I didn't really need another SLG. So I thought I'd buy it for you guys and do a little giveaway. So it comes in all the packaging, and oh, look how pretty. So this is only if you like kind of pinks and purples, it is quite a vibrant color, but I thought it was so stunning. Has the YSL logo in gold on the front, and then it has the beautiful interior. So it's all grain leather, so very, very durable. And it is a proper little wallet. So it's pretty much the exact same layout as the Gucci card holder that I have. So you have a space for your notes, space for cards, and then also a space for coins as well. So this could literally be your entire wallet. You do have the Saint Laurent stamping on the inside as well. Just everything that you could possibly want. And just look at that color. Oh, and you also have a pocket on the back as well. I almost forgot that. So, so beautiful. So if you want to be in with a chance of winning this, it's so simple to enter. Literally all you have to do is one, be subscribed to my channel, and two, just comment down below saying that you'd like to enter. That's it, there are no further steps. I wanted to keep this one super simple because I always get comments that people don't always have Instagram and other channels, so it's YouTube only, you just have to subscribe and then comment down below saying that you would like to enter the giveaway. The giveaway is open internationally, so absolutely anyone can enter, it doesn't matter where you are. I will leave all the details down below, including the expiration date of the giveaway and any rules that I've forgotten, but it's a very, very simple giveaway, just two steps as I mentioned, be subscribed and comment down below saying that you'd like to enter and I will pick the winner at random and then I will announce it back on this channel. So if you check the description section, then I will update the description with the winner name. But I will also private message the winner letting them know that they have one as well. So that is it for this video, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you have any questions for me, then let me know down below, but I will leave links to everything I featured as well as sizes in the description section below. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you in my next one. Bye.